Hello everybody and welcome back to the lab. This is the animal department of the lab. So we're going to be talking about a new dinosaur announced, the Dino Keris. So I have covered this in detail on a video here if you want to check that out after this. But we're going to go through the concept art today and some more theories and the new information on update 4 and 4.5. So let's get straight into it. But don't forget guys, as always, if you found this video helpful or you've gained some more information, don't forget to click that like button and subscribe because there's plenty more content on the channel. So looking at this concept art, they've gone for a mixture of feathered and non-feathered, as we can see here. You can see the rough scale of the dinosaur as well, and how big it is compared to a human. So this feather variation and non-feather variation, I have seen it before, but mainly you see feathered or non-feathered. You can see it all in the screenshots behind as well. It looks like it's got some beefy ass claws, they're pretty big, they look like some tasty shredders they're going to be shredding up some dinosaurs in the aisle you can tell straight away i'm not a massive fan of the duck look personally but i know a lot of people are and this is the community dinosaur you can see the feet there on the right hand side as well very reminiscent of the the bird like cherry as we all uh, come to know it in the Isle official discord um, and it looks very interesting uh, as you can see you know it's a quite large animal and it's going to be quite scary to see in the Isle primarily this is going to be an omnivore and um, be feasting in the rivers uh, I couldn't imagine it being a massive swimmer but it should be able to to go up to its waist quite easily in water and still be pretty fast and powerful because it has got their big beefy legs which is very very interesting if you want to know more about this animal i covered it in depth a few days ago when it initially got released on the isles twitter account see the video in the top right hand corner there and check that out now as for update 4 and 4.5 you can see here from the discord announcement from punch packet that it is full steam ahead for update 4 and 4.5 and they're basically nearly complete on the packy. So we don't get confused guys, the packy is update 4.5, not update 4. Update 4 is diets and fractures, again which I've gone into a lot of detail on on previous videos. So I don't want to bore you guys with the same old information. We're here today to talk about the Dino Keris, aka the Cherry, with this concept art. But we've also been told that update 4 and 4.5 is full steam ahead and they've added new programmers, new coders to update 4 and 4.5 to help it go a lot smoother and a lot faster, which is fantastic. You know, they say to keep their eyes peeled on the roadmap because they will see plenty of ticks coming down the pipeline, animation wise it says. But um, very, very interesting time. What do you guys think of this community creature? Do you like it? Is this what you expected? Did you want something else? The Titan Boa, perhaps? Is that what you wanted? The Titan Boa? Um, <clears throat> very, very interesting for me. Do you guys like it? Do you not like it? Personally, I'm on the fence. It kind of looks like a duck to me. <laughs> and um, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, I like my dinosaurs. I know it's an omnivore, and I understand that. But I like my dinosaurs for some teeth and scales. Ugh. And I've said that previously. But don't get me wrong, I love the feathers on some dinosaurs. And the colour patterns can look absolutely fantastic on some dinosaurs. So I am very much looking forward to seeing this in the aisle. Because it brings a lot of diversity and new play styles with it. Don't forget guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to see more. I've been Shadows coming to you live from Shadow Labs. Hope you've enjoyed it. See you all in the next one.